I guess you can say... I love how I start this- I love how I start this and... I get a phone call from Jordan. <laughs> Recording a video? Oh, Alright guys, so I have a lot of editing and a lot of stuff to do, but like I said, uh, we got acquire information and grand summoners, which, but before we get into that information, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Guys, if you haven't watched my a couple past my videos and you uh, just now watching this one trying to catch up, um, you can go watch the past ones too. But I said uh, in my videos I have a couple goals for 2020 and I'm trying to hit 10,000 subscribers this uh, this year before it gets to 2021. So I want to hit it at least by December 31st of 2020 this year. I want to get 10,000 subscribers. I know we can do it. So please hit that like button. Please subscribe. Just uh, help your boy out. We try, let's try to get above 25 likes each video. Then the goal will keep on going up. So hit that 25 likes. Let's go and share. All right. We'll be posting. We literally post daily. And we're going to be doing some double uploads too with Grand Summoners, Dragon Ball. And we're going to do some reviews of some new MMO games. You know, 7 Day Insense is coming out. Uh, one, week, one guy wants me to play Art Night. Uh, we're going to be playing some more mobile games and gotcha games that I have found out um, about that I really think that uh you guys should see see and i kind of want to put on the channel uh, i have a lot of content coming i've been recording all day still editing the intro i have a lot to do but let's get into this video all right so uh, after this video please somebody comment down below download um uh, re-download blue stacks or download ld player because i cannot use nox no more it's nox is horrible for grand summoners but on uh, when I, I when I play Last Call Audio on Grand Summoners, it's perfectly fine. So I don't know what's wrong. So with the first thing we're gonna get into, we're gonna get into Racky. Racky is the is Daki's brother. They don't know that they're twin brothers, but um, yeah, that's the story. They don't know they're ten, twin brothers and they fight each other. Blah blah blah. So yeah, now we got Racky and Daki. Another step up banner, you guys know. Uh, the song is better is Racky. 34k dark damage increases only. Alright, editing sleepy here. Uh just know. Uh I don't I would like bruh. I did not know I was using a Dragon Ball Legends background. I'm a fool. Don't mind that. But the art looks amazing, but don't mind that, bruh. I'm sorry. <laughs> Back to the video. It's by two every hit. It reduces enemy light and dark resistance by 20% for 10 seconds. That is a true arch passion. Flower silence. Now, he kind of got a diverse uh, equipment. He has a five-star attack, five-star magic, and a four-star support, which is real good. I, I like that. I like that a little diversity. Then he got the four-star support. I, mwah, mwah. I, I, I support that a lot. I love that so much. Overall, you know, it's Racky and Daki, pretty similar. One's dark, one's light. Um, this is stacks right here. Nox is messing up. I hate when it does this. This is one thing I hate. It does this only on Grand Summoners. Uh, Y'all know about Nice Sandstone. Sandstone is a good tank unit. Got two five stars. I can't. I can't do this. I can't do this. All right, there we go. Okay, we 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 just gotta go past Sandstone because it stops right here. All right, we got Platina. Everybody knows about Plat OG unit. 34 credit light damage and higher chance of reducing the enemy reduces enemy rate gauge by 20 percent and skill high hit. Excuse me for 20 seconds. Uh, a good diverse uh, equipment slot as a five star physical, four five star shield and a four star support. Same with Nice. Nice is most like a tank unit. His art is pretty decent. Um, I love his true art on him with 35k war damage reduces all allies damage by 80% for three seconds. I I won't, won't share that more of a tank unit. I, I like that a lot. Has a five star physical, a five star uh, magic, a potion, and a four star shield. Uh, wish I wish he would have had a five star shield and a four star magic potion, but you know. It is what it is. Then we got rags on on this baby rag shirt. Y'all know about rags. 30, 30,050 dark damage uses 30% on uh owns negates HP damage from the damage enemy by 3,000 for 25 seconds. I said that completely wrong. High chance of fading the enemy. Um yeah, again, diverse equipment, five star attack, five star magic, and a five star support. Yes, this is a unit with all five stars equipment. Uh rags, great unit. Um I like them a lot. He's a great unit. Platina is great. Nice is great. Sandstone, uh, decent have. Um, she, you can definitely use her for certain, um, I'd say bosses or uh, events that you need to go against that you need to have her if you don't have certain other tank units or certain units. Um, kind of need her. 
to be honest. Racky and Dacky, I know my opinion on Racky and Dacky. That's just, it's Racky and Dacky, so, you know. Um, now we got the Blood Knights is back. <laughs> okay, so we got the Birdwick uh, Part 1. It's just Act 1, Part 1 of Birdwick. That was the first Blood Knight that we got on Global. Um, so, yeah, his uh, event is back. It's going to be as a side quest now. Uh, it's going to be here permanently. Now, um, if you didn't know, JP already had this. Uh, last year like in November or probably even way before that I think it was around the time when they established they had all um, the events uh, permanently there uh, which is real good oh uh, but the equipment info this was a lot of people miss out on uh, is Fumaha and Bloodcrest Arcanite um, so these are two great equips especially Arcanite once this event comes you do not want to miss out you want to have this and you want to use this okay so first Fire Scepter, Formal Heart, uh, is attack 500, CT is 50 seconds of break, it's 800, Earth Killer is level 2 damage, if the enemy is 10% of skills, 6,000 fire damage, magic reduces the enemy resistance, fire resistance by 30% for, um, 10 seconds, now the CT is actually not that bad, um, it's only 50 seconds, it is a powerful equip, uh, you can use this on Bird Wick, I actually have it on my Norn, don't, don't ask me why I have it on my Norn, um, on this account, I have it on my Norn, don't, or, the giveaway account i have it on my norm don't ask why don't ask why okay um now we're getting into blood crest this is a four star support equipment one of the best four star support equipments that i have ever used um it has an hp of 60 attack of 30 and a defense of 30 a six a ct of 15 seconds blood crest arc and knight the skill ct down is level two the skill ct down is 10 percent down uh the skill increases all allies are gauged by 10 percent which is wah, wah, amazing. Now, this you could run if you're running this with uh, multiple support units that have a four star uh, support star, even a five star support star. You can put it in a five star uh, support star, but if you have a better better equipment like um, limb clothes or something, magic steel mask, um, or even promos that you can put in a five star magic uh, steel slot, I would definitely or five star support. I would definitely put that there and definitely put this in a four star uh, four star slot one. Just because, uh, so we have more R gauge, that's similar to you probably give off. Uh, but this uh, equipment gives R gauge to the team, all allies, as I said right there, which is a great. Um, it's real good. You know, guys, I like to have that um, non selfish equips. I said this before. I like to have um, R gauge for my characters because it's one of the most important things to have for your units is R gauge and make sure they're actually, you know. Fueling and getting something, you know, you want to have the right equips on the units. If you don't have equipment on the units and it's not leveled up, you're really not doing anything. Uh, you're going to be doing stuff, but when you go against the uh, harder bosses, you're not really doing anything, really. Um, so, all right, so we got Rivies, we got Tempest. I got, I, I don't want to really want to go over Tempest. This, I really don't like Tempest overall. You really don't, people don't really use it. It does a lot of, it does a lot of damage, but uh, the CT is like 100 seconds. <laughs> Uh, over 100 seconds, so yeah. Uh, eighth battle dress. We're gonna hit these pretty fast. It's five seconds. It's a decent equip with a break of 200 and attack of 500. With 1.7k earth damage, magic increases its own attack and reduces its own defense by 20% for five seconds. That is the skill for the magic equip. With water killer, uh, it's great to do water damage and um, overall, uh, I think it's decent. Now we got Thetis. Uh, now I have run Adam's Gear, Diamond Shield, Adam's Gear. I think it's great. His sword is not as good, it's decent, but it's not as good as I thought it was going to be. Uh, it's pretty decent, but uh, it's not really something that I really want to go over on this channel, uh, or on this video at least. Uh, but it has an attack of 500, break of 900, CT of uh, 50 seconds, and a 7k water damage physical increase on defense by 30% for 50 seconds, which is actually pretty decent. But um, there's certain quests that you can use out there that's way better, but it's actually not a bad equip to use. Now we're going into Fox. We have his uh, weapon right here. I don't know how to pronounce that. So Judgment Blade uh, Physical. Uh, it does 8k water damage physical. It reduces its own skill CT by 50% for 10 seconds with a CT of 40 seconds. What does heck this happen? Oh, there we go. Okay. Then we got Demon Grab, Riller, Stola. Uh, CT 50 seconds. HP is 120. Both good. You can definitely run a different hill equip. You can definitely run something better than this. Definitely run something better than this. Um, 
it's not bad, but you can definitely run some better than this just because this uh, CT is mostly high and you only um, heal the HP by 30%. And it's only the target HP. You can drag the other units, but you can only use it on one unit. Now going to Sword Wick, now you have his attack 5% up uh, for the fire boost and you have Blazing Coat with the negates all damage for a total of 500 reduces enemies by 20% and only 15 seconds with a CT of 45 seconds. Um, these equipment, not bad. I like both equipment. Um, I like how it increases the stats. You can low-key. It increases all ally stats. I like that. We've been running a sword, a cursed life sword, even though cursed life sword only goes to that certain unit. Uh, that you have it on this goes to all allies so i really like that going to the beautiful the beautiful princess now we have her star uh star etcher and i can't i i don't see the name i forgot i forgot what it was um this note it increases all allies archage by 20 increases all allies archage by one for 10 seconds which i like this the one thing i don't like is this on um, ct i wish it was like 50 seconds instead of 60 uh, but they do have to have some kind of the like balance to it, so I understand that. Uh, on the second equip, it uh, auto fills are gets by one near death. These are the equip, uh, a decent magic equip, four star magic. I really like the five star uh, support one better, but that's just me. Now, the coffin for Leon's, um, two decent equipment. Uh, I hate when it starts messing up like this. Oh my gosh, this makes me so sad. Our field are by 10 minutes for 20 seconds. Increase all allies to a critical rate by 50 seconds and 10 seconds. Depending on what equipment you use, you can uh, actually tank with her. I said tank, you can actually um, literally nuke with her. So now going into Duke. Now we have Duke equipment. Y'all guys know about Duke equipment. We have Vanish or Oscar Blade. Damage 10 percent up during break. Uh, this is a pretty much a break equipment. You can run this from Wargo too. Uh, you can run this, of course, on uh as a run or you can run this on duke or any other breaker in the game um this is real good especially if they're dark damage too um that was all dark demons uh, dark units i just named right there so you could run them on them uh the ct 60 seconds and the break is 1800 now going to the second equip can't see the name uh damage reduction for near death with a defense 120 uh negates all allies light damage for a total of 800 for 10 seconds so you just be able to good to run against a wilkes or other light bosses or crest palace that would be able to good to run now guys as you see we got freedom fighters uh you know we got a couple of missions that you get some crystal from uh so for free to play players you can go there and see what missions you can do it's just basically just do the uh the freedom the freedom fighter stuff and yeah that's pretty much it upcoming maintenance is the banner this was coming uh this banner right here that we already went over that's pretty much it gonna be for this video guys i hope you enjoyed it let's hit 10,000 subscribers and um let's just get straight to it i appreciate all you guys dragon ball kakarot is literally coming tomorrow literally tomorrow it's thursday it's here um it's no games we're, we're creating content we do playthroughs um a little bit different over here it's not you're gonna be a regular playthrough it's gonna be some content all right so be ready um a lot of a lot of videos are gonna be up soon and um january from now to uh, all the way like this whole year it's gonna be getting uh just freaking fresh and games is just gonna be dropping we have a lot of games to go over a lot of videos to do um so subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Have an amazing day. Stay beautiful. I love you guys. Mwah.